actually managed to follow me all the way here. You truly are pests. So that's the wave machine you're holding. I can feel the waves. This is what Curlin was talking about. Yes. She started on it long ago, prior to my awakening. She used that to seal the power and souls of every one of Earth's warriors. She was probably hoping to devour them all while they were paralyzed. I see. That's a pretty convoluted plan. I agree. It is also a very risky plan. In addition, since she and I both possess power, the waves also affect the both of us. Then why did she want to activate it? She'll only end up sealing her own powers. Naturally, she prepared herself for that danger as well. At that time, I had just fallen into a deep sleep, and she assumed I would never resurface. And then, the waves ended up having a greater effect on her 
than she ever could have planned or imagined. In the end, it was her weakened state that allowed me to be woken. Ironically, I only managed to suppress her then, due to how surprised she was. If you knew that much, why didn't you just go out and find the machine yourself? You are aware that you could have easily increased the output to further suppress me. Well, I couldn't. <laughs> There's no need to be worried. I should be thanking you, really. I'm only here now because you couldn't find it. You failed the <laughs> test after all. However, leaving it intact will only cause problems. So I guess I'm left with no other choice. No! This is <laughs> disgusting! What a horrible aftertaste of garbage! Oh man! She swallowed it! But the machine is emitting waves! If she swallows that... Ooh, do I say that you're worried? Isn't that so very kind? It's okay! Because that machine was just the controller. Swallowing it wasn't the least bit dangerous. Huh? And now it seems nearly useless and unable to send out any waves. No! If you want to beat me that badly, go on a sweet binge and strengthen yourself. Oh, wait! I guess that'd make you a hypocrite now, wouldn't it? I hate you! Okay, then. Guess I might as well finish you off, since you're here at all. Eighteen, are you okay? What took you so long, you idiot? Hey, what happened? You're all beat up. This looks bad. Goku, finally. Goku. I'll hold her off while you go and get some sensu beans from Corin. Okay, hold on. Huh? He disappeared? Goku will be right back. Meantime, we need to hold her off. Huh? You're back already? No worries. Corin already had some prepared. Here, everyone, eat these. You are going to regret this. I've heard. You're the bad half of 21, isn't that right? How do you know about that? Sorry, I'll explain later. It looks like he somehow found out about everything. And also, was that instant transmission just now? He's as dangerous as I feared. There is no doubt. I think you can still give me a good challenge, though. about when I 
tried to save you? Just forget about it. I mean, you didn't actually want to fight me, right? Besides, it seemed different from how you normally fight. Like you were going easy on me. I knew there had to be some reason. Oh, Krillin, you know me so well. <laughs> So Dende told you what you need to know, right? The monster you're dealing with here? Yeah. That android can turn people into kin and eat them. Right? Just like Majin Buu. Maybe. It's possible that at some point in her development, someone put the same kind of cells in her body. If that's the case, then she'll eventually lose all control over her hunger. Well, then, we're going to have to put a stop to her before she ends up eating every last person on Earth. Huh? Huh? What is it? Did I say something weird? N not exactly. You're really going to help me? Of course. We did come to this place looking for a fight, after all. B but... You need to relax, 21. These two, they're not going to go down easily. I thought she had a pretty tight guard, although I bet she's still actually hiding her true power. Ooh, man! I can't wait to fight her! This is gonna be fun! He's always been like that. You don't have to worry about him getting involved. <laughs> you were all so concerned. Turned out to be nothing. I'm so grateful for all of your help. Hey, don't mention it. Curlin, you must have some idea as to what's next. First, we should go find everyone else. What? More people are going to help us? Yeah, as a matter of fact, Vegeta's riding in Bulma's plane as we speak. I'm pretty sure that they'll be able to help out, too. Thank you so much. Okay, we need to go. We have to get everyone.
I've had better. I guess clones won't be enough to satisfy me. They taste bland, and they don't possess much energy. Oh well, it doesn't matter. I need as much strength as I can get. If I'm right, my lesser half is probably going to team up with Goku and all of his friends. No matter. I'm sure every last one of them can only lend a finite amount of power. And there's only one way for her to power herself up. She'll eventually have to give in to her hunger. In the end, will that hypocrite finally give in and feed or not? Whatever. No point in pondering it. Ultimately, only she can make the decision. I'm just going to keep eating more and more in the meantime. <laughs> just 
Do you wait and see? This is bad. The clones that used to be out there have all disappeared now. It seems that the other 21 must be eating them. This rate, the next time we see her, she is going to have some monster strength. There's no question. That, that means we have no choice but to hurry, too. I guess we'll just have to keep defeating enemies until we find her. If she's still eating them, we should run into her sooner or later. True. It's not like we have any other clues to work off of at this point. How annoying. We should just go and find the other 21 and destroy her right now. I didn't want to, but she's really powered herself up. We probably won't be able to beat her just yet. Defeating the clones will boost your link ratio. You need to work to unlock more of your power. <clears throat> okay, then. We can do this together. We just need to defeat more clones, right? That is correct. And if things don't work out, I'll... Huh? Oh, it's nothing. Okay, let's get to work.
more time. I think I've gotten pretty used to this link thing. I feel like my power's back. It's back to normal now. No matter how much you boost your link ratio, it'll only restore your original power. But new power is the only way we're going to win this. Hey, it'd be dangerous if we had two people that strong duking it out here. You'd end up destroying the Earth. That's true, Krillin. The normal attacks probably won't mean a thing to her. We have no choice. Perhaps we should plan to have the final battle somewhere else. Hold on. Listen up. I got an idea. <laughs> really? That's just great. I'm not sure we can trust one of your ideas. Your plans aren't exactly foolproof, you know. What? Are you joking? Make sure you think long and hard about it first. Man, you guys are sure letting him have it. Uh, you'll soon understand why. Goku isn't exactly the most reliable person. He does always screw things up somehow. Hey, don't say that. Look, I'll tell you about my idea after I defeat all the clones. Fine. We'll leave things to you for the time being. Yeah, it's time. Okay, everyone, let's do this.
Goku, I think the whole planet's been wiped clean of clones. We managed to defeat a lot of them, but it looks like she's been busy too. Yeah, now we must be the only ones that are left on her plate. <laughs> Don't say it like that. <laughs> Good. We should all go out and say hello then. Yeah, there's no reason to sit around waiting for her to come to us. I can feel 21's gigantic aura coming from over there. Okay, let's go! Everyone, grab on to me. Will he 
keep waiting for you.
capabilities are off the charts. We need to destroy every last cell of her, or she'll just keep coming back. Great. Another boom. Well, in that case, there's only one thing we can do. We'll have to finish this with a spirit bomb. Sorry, everyone, but can you all buy me some time while I gather energy? <sighs> Don't. 
too. Please take care of the other soul inside. We all do a great deal. Oh dear, looks like we are a bit late. Lord Eris, what are you doing here? Bulma said she'd prepare a feast for me, so I went over to her place. You mean you were worried about this? The fate of Earth is resting on it. Yeah? So where's that Android 21 right now? hit by the spirit bomb. Looks like the bad one caught the spirit bomb, and then the good one just ran in after. I see. She must have understood what the best course of action was. Due to her abnormal urges to feed, she would have surely become a danger again someday. Thus, she decided to end it all herself. She sacrificed her life to protect the planet. It's not something anyone could do. 21. Oh! In that case, we'll have to thank her the next time we see her. Huh? Have you lost your mind? Don't tell me that you want to bring her back with the Dragon Balls. No, no. Using the Dragon Balls just wouldn't be right. Considering how she sacrificed herself, I'll talk to King Yemma. He should be able to reincarnate her. What? You can actually do that? I won't know until I try. You're just making this up. I doubt that he'll just nod his head and do it, though. Well, I could just ask for you. After all, it's got nothing to do with me. Perhaps all your hard work could make him inclined to do a favor for you. Really? <clears throat> but before you go and see King Yemma, you need to go back to Earth and finish this. Finish this? What else do I have to do? You need to return whoever's in 18 back to their original body, don't you? Oh, right. So, I guess this is goodbye, huh? It went by fast, but I really owe you. Hey, don't be sad. I'm sure you'll meet each other again someday. I mean, I died like a couple of times and still got to see everyone. Unbelievable. <laughs> so much for mourning the dead, huh? I wanted to thank you so much for fighting with us. You're the best. Next time we meet, that is, if you're up for it, we should have ourselves a friendly spa. Anyway, 